Our next pose is saddle pose, also known as hero pose. Now this can be one that's really tough on the lower back, the ankles, the knees, the quads. So be very gentle to your body. Just accept where it's at. And if you feel it in your lower back, you'll want to come out of it and not go so deep into it. Now I'm going to do a very modified position uh, showing you with props so that it's more accessible to the majority. But if you're advanced enough and know how to go right into hero pose, feel free to do so. So take your blocks and set them up as if you were going into heart bench. So you've got the one in back standing up tall. The middle one will be on the middle height and this will be under your back. The other one's for your head and we're going to take a bolster and lay it over the top and you want it somewhat stable there. Take another blanket, roll the blanket up and place it right here in front of those blocks. Okay, so you're nice and steady and then we're going to straddle the blanket. That's elevating our hips up. If you need more, you can do a second blanket or another bolster to sit on. And then you're just going to slowly come on back, holding everything in place and lay on back, settling in. Your arms are down by your side. If you'd like to have more of a shoulder stretch, you can take your arms up over your head, grabbing your elbows. If you choose this one, just know it can get intense pretty quickly. And at any point, you're welcome to release and come down. And also, if you're in that one about halfway through, you may want to sh uh, change your arms so the other one is on top. So find your position that's comfortable for you. And begin to relax. And once again, if you feel it too much in your lower back, you may need to raise your hips a little more. You may need another block or two to elevate yourself up a little higher, and that's okay. Take a deep breath in, and a deep breath out.
attention to your breath. Deep breath in. And take breath out. And slowly press into your elbows, hands to your feet, lift your chest up, forward, and up. Bring your hands to your knees. Just take a breath here, and then as you're ready, come over onto all fours into your hands and knees and then you can swing your legs around and come to a seated position on the mat and you can set your blocks and props aside just take one more breath in one more breath out I like to just take a gentle side twist very gentle, nothing too deep. Now we're ready to go to the next 